Hi guys, in order for you to be successful and to have growth in life and to accomplish all the dreams that you set in front of you, you have to spend some time to find out who you are. So self-awareness is key for you to move from one place to the next. If you don't know yourself, you can't expect to know other people and you can't expect for you guys to grow as a society, as a community, as a business, as just culture in general. So re you really need to spend some time to know yourself and what I have today is four zones that will help you identify where you are and where you can go to. Now there's a saying that says, in order for things to change, you have to change. So when you're considering the four zones, know that you can change from one zone to the next very easily. I want to start off with the first zone, which is the comfort zone. That is the lowest zone that you can find. And in this zone, you usually feel that you want to control things. You usually feel safety in this zone. There's usually a sense of routine and you don't want to change anything, you just want things to remain the same. And this is the zone where usually no change happens. But in order for you to move from this comfort zone into what we call the second zone, which is the fear zone, is for you to really start thinking and looking at your life and looking at things and to realize that even if you're thinking things you won't try them because you'll have excuses. You'll have the fear of not trying things. You'll have the fear of other people judging you. And in this way, you will procrastinate. So there's a lot of procrastination in the second stage, which is the fear stage. But the more you think about things and the more you think about the excuses that you're making and the excuses that are stopping you from taking any action, the more you think about it, you'll find yourself that you're stuck and you're not moving from one place to the next. And then you'll realize that if I don't change, nothing will change. And that's where you enter into the learning, the learning zone, which is the third zone. And in this zone, you realize that change can happen. And you realize that you have to face things. You have to face challenges in order for you to possibly go to the fourth stage, which is the growth zone or the growth mindset. In the learning stage, you'll find yourself solving a lot of problems. You'll find yourself trying to take on a lot of challenges and that you can hopefully learn from them and that you can hopefully grow from them. This is the stage that is very important in the learning of new skills new techniques, new methods for you to become a better person. And if you get to a point where you sort of mastered the learning stage and you're constantly learning and you're constantly improving, you'll enter into what we call the fourth stage or the fourth zone, which is the growth zone. In this zone, you will find yourself setting goals. You will find yourself achieving things. You will find yourself living a life that is meaningful, a life that is contributing to your betterment and to the betterment of other people. You'll soon find yourself taking on a lot of action steps that will make all your dreams come true and that you'll find yourself living a very good life. So this growth zone is the zone that everyone needs to aspire to be in. If you're in a comfortable zone. You need to look at yourself and you need to think, how can I get there? How can I get to the growth zone where everything is just happening for me? Now, it's very easy to ask yourself the question today, in which zone am I in this current moment? Because you can easily be in a growth zone and then you get too comfortable once again and then you find yourself having created another comfort zone where you've become comfortable with 
setting goals so you don't set bigger goals. You've become comfortable with seeing things happening for you and you're not taking any more action because you just think things will happen by themselves. So you find yourself dropping back into this comfort zone and then it'll just start over again because you start fearing things again. You start fearing other people's opinions of you. You start fearing, what if I try things and things don't work? And then you stop yourself from learning. You stop yourself from uh, accumulating knowledge and wisdom. And in this way, you can't really grow. You can't really grow. So you guys, it's very easy for people to move between these stages. It's very easy for them to excel and then find themselves dropping down again. Personally, for myself, I think the comfort zone is something I, I fall back to now and again. I admit that. But I'm finding myself a lot in the learning stage, in the growing stage. And I'm sort of fluctuating between them. You can't fully just stay in this stage. I think the two best stages to stay in is the learning zone and the growing zone because you're constantly learning things. You're constantly growing and as you're growing, you're learning things. But try not to come back to these two zones, the fear zone and the comfortable zone. Guys, I certainly hope this helps to identify where you are and know that it's possible that if you do take action, if you do really do look at yourself, you can really know where you are. And once you know where you are, you can really set a course to where you want to go to, a direction that you want to move in. So take some time, really look at these four zones, see where you are and envision where you want to go to. I really hope this helps. Thank you so much for watching. Stay well and stay blessed.